Matthew Coward Brown. Speaking with Tiana. Oh, oh, hey Tiana. Oh, my name's Darren. Um, I've um just lo- lost my uh, prescription for um for, I have one for uh Valium, and uh, I had one for uh some uh, painkiller that um that one that's like morphine or something. That's one that like that, but I've lost that uh, prescription, and I'm just calling um around just give his heads up. Um, I'm I'm coming in, but but I can't. I don't have the uh, the prescription anymore. Must have like gone through the wash and that. And I called the doctors and that, but they closed. They closed at five thirty, so I can't I can't get it today. But um, I'm just like in pain and that. So like um, I'm just giving his heads up. Like I'm coming in right, and um, I'm just gonna um, I'll, I'll prove I, I've got my license and that. So you can like take take my name, <laughs> and um yeah I'll just go come and get the um val- Valium and then that um that some painkiller too I forget what it's called. Yeah, um I'll just let you know that we legally won't be able to give you those medications without a prescription. Um, but so what? It, but the doctor already said that um I need that because like I came off my um BMX bike like um two days ago. And um, like I've got like shoulder, sh- my shoulders like uh, k- keeps like popping out and that. So like, he's he needs me uh, on it, and uh, he said that he said that. So like, he did say it. Like I can like like I'm I'll come that. get him. Like I don't lie. Like I'm that's one thing about me. Eh? Like I'm fucking straight shooter. Like I don't like I don't lie on that. Like I know some people probably like come in and say, oh I'm sick and that, try and get drugs and that. But like I don't touch it. You know, I, only thing I have a couple of beers every night. That's it. So I'm just coming in. Doctor's bloody said right. He said it. So like that's that should cover that that legal part. That's that done because the because the doctor said that I can. Yeah, yeah. Well, um, you can if you have a prescription. We just can't legally give you the medication. Um, just over the counter. We will need that physical prescription. Um, what? What if he? Um, could, what if I write a letter saying? I write a letter saying, uh, pharmacy, um, Darren here. Uh, the doctor said I can have Valium and uh, painkiller, and then like no. I'll sign it. I'll sign it, and then um, I'll come and show you that that letter that I wrote. And you can hang on that. You can hang on to that one. Yeah, unfortunately, we still wouldn't be able to give you any medication over the counter. We will still need that um, before, legal before prescription before. to dispense anything. I've had. Um, I, th- I think I've I've come to your pharmacy before, but in in someone like I, I said this to the doctor last time because i've lost scripts before right and and then the pharmacist was like oh yeah like like i showed i showed them like an email or something from the doctor and then they was like oh yeah all right yeah no he needs it and then they gaze they gaze me the the valium and that so like it's happened before so like i know you like worrying about legals and that but like I promise you, like, like if I write the letter, like that's it. Like cops can't do nothing. Like trust me, <laughs> trust me on that, buddy. Cops around here. Yeah, just if you if you hand something from the doctor that's signed by the doctor. Um, yeah, they just closed really, now. Um, they just um, closed, but scrape up potentially. But um, no, no. If if you don't have anything um, from the doctor, or a prescription, we won't be able to dispense or give you any medication. Oh, it's like so like annoying right now, but what what hear me out, right? One last little trick here. What if I, right? What if I email the doctor saying, Hey mate, just D- Dazza here, mate, just uh lost me script, um, and like you you need to put me on another one and that. And then I'll show you the email that I wrote to him. Cause that's something from the doctor, right? And I can write the letter on top of that. And then you can keep that. That's yours. Yeah, yeah unfortunately, yeah, we still, um, we can't use that or anything. We will still need a legal prescription. Um, right, well, we can't go off of um, anything that you've signed or anything. We'll need something directly from the doctor. Well, all right, I'll see what's going on. All right, I can see what you're doing here. All right, well, how much then? Hmm? I've got cash. What do, you, what do you want for it? I can give you, uh, what, two, 250 for a fucking twenty pack of vouchers, hmm? is that you've you bloody? Is, I can see what you're doing, and and all right, I'll I'll bring the cash in. You just give me the amount. No, 
Well, unfortunately, um, I would still need a legal prescription from the doctor. Martha, everyone's got a price, Martha. You tell me what your price is, all right? Just it's don't a get prescription from the doctor. Just don't get outrageous. What what do you want? What how much do you want? I can I can bring in what five hundred? Is that what you want? Five hundred cash. You're more than welcome to come in and have a conversation if you want. With the cash. But, so um, unfortunately we would need that Bring the email, bring the letter. Well I'll cash. I'll do the email and do the letter and come in and, and talk to you about it and I'll and I'll bring the cash and don't worry I won't say nothing in the pharmacist or whatever hey, thanks for all this is Joel the pharmacist on duty tonight hello sorry who's this hello this is Joel the pharmacist on duty tonight from Sanjeev Knight yeah, I'm the pharmacist on duty tonight on the phone on to Chi Chi tonight hello can you what do you say bro hello yeah can you hear me bro oh, I can't hear anything hello it's very crackly Oh, he's fucking pulled me leg or some shit. You can't hear me. Can you hear me, mate? What the f- <laughs> Oh, dude. That is the most fucking <laughs> unlikable character. But fucking unbelievable how well you play it. Holy That's Darren. shit. <laughs> it's good to know that they're straight shooters at that pharmacy. I love just hearing you fucking talk. I, I, you can just pretend to prank call and there's no one on the other line. Yeah, we've done that before too. I just want to hear Darren talk shit. The prank calls to no one. Well, it's good oh. to see they're straight shooters and they um, don't accept money and bribes of any kind for any <laughs> drugs. We sort of helped. Like Now we know because I've always wondered, surely they have a price? Yeah. Well, like now people know not to try that. 